Hey y'all, I'm here today because I'm I'm asking for help. I've been feeling really depressed. My self-esteem has been really low. I've been experiencing a lot of anxiety and sleepless nights <sighs> because there's been a couple people bullying me and um, they've been talking down to me and humiliating me and insulting me and making me feel like I, I there's no reason for me to live. <sighs> I'm really having a hard time and I'm asking for help. Listen, I just want to say for those of you that may have been experiencing this or may have experienced it, it's not the end of the world. I know it hurts and I know it's painful. I ha myself have experienced those things. I have experienced a lot of bullying, but I am here to tell you that when you ask for help, you should be able to get help. If you are one of those people that stand on the sidelines and see somebody experiencing those effects of bullying that I said, depression, anxiety, low self-esteem, uh, those things that I said earlier, if you see that, talk to people. Mental health is real. And some people cannot deal with it, so they commit suicide. Y'all, we have to speak up for those that can't speak up for themselves. So if you are doing that, if you are making people feel that way and calling them names and just being mean, if you are doing that, you are a bully. If you're on the sidelines and you're watching it and you're not saying anything, you may as well be agreeing with it because you're not speaking up and helping that person. Um, I don't know how you might feel if you find out that person committed suicide because they couldn't withstand the pressure, but you didn't uh, speak up for them. They couldn't do it for themselves and you saw that. So it's our job to speak up and to help the person that's experiencing those things. If you are, um, if you join in with the bully and you start and you start calling them names and insulting them and humiliating them, you are a secondary bully and you're not helping the situation. Um, again, mental health is real. I um, ask y'all to, and men, the mental health hotline is 988. So I ask you to speak up and help those that you see are vulnerable and fearful and can't speak up for themselves. We have to help each other. So this is Breaking Bullying News with Stephanie, and I will see y'all back. That's the news for this week. Watch out for other people. Help them speak up on their behalf. I will see you next week. I'm Breaking Bullying News with Stephanie. Take care and bye for now.